Head said wrestling coach Scott Goodale. Uh, coach, the team is finally returning home to the College Ave gym this Saturday. Face Lock Haven. Uh, first time in over a month. You guys will be wrestling here. Uh, how excited do you think the team is to return home? Uh, you know, it's just the travel's been, uh, you know, anytime you travel, it just takes you out of your comfort zone a little bit. It's always nice being home because you're used to everything that goes on. So that's always special. Plus, to be back in Jersey in front of our fans uh, it should be a great crowd, you know, with some of the things we're doing and embrace the embrace the kids foundation all that good stuff so we're excited about it it's lock haven it'll be a really really good duel so it's great to be back home from start to finish uh, how do you think this team has grown in this road stretch against these tough teams uh yeah it's been hard you know you, you don't know yet really right you got to find out how we bounce back if we continue you know if you feel sorry for yourself because we lost three in a row and you you fall on your face this match then you find out a little bit about your, your guys so we're hoping that doesn't happen the object is to you know, wrestle those hard teams, learn from it, build from it, get better from it, and, and now you know you're battle tested. And uh, again, it's still a strong test, though. So we'll see how they respond. You know, from from losing three matches in a row. I, I do know this, though. This team needs a win, and that's kind of been our mindset. Now, with the match Saturday, uh, your alma mater will be returning to the College Ave gym. Uh, what's that like coaching against this, the the school you wrestled at? You know, way back and kind of learned it. Uh, it's pretty cool. I'm a proud Lock Haven guy. You know, that's a small school in central Pennsylvania that is rich in wrestling tradition. Um, it's a great place. Coach Moore is a great guy doing a great job and I'm happy he's really bringing that thing back. Uh, makes me proud uh, to watch those guys wrestle and be a part of that tradition and, and to bring him here or bring them here and, and Coach Moore is it's kind of special for me. We've been out there a couple times. We've wrestled a couple times since I've been here but it's always nice to have Lock even on the schedule again. It's one of the teams obviously I follow, follow quite a bit uh, you know, through the course of the year. Then a big day planned for Saturday, a Greek day, Embrace Kids Day. Uh, program is trying to sell out the College Ave gym in the hopes of, you know, helping benefit the Embrace Kids uh, Foundation. Uh, what does that mean to you when this team's trying to, you know, really help a great organization, a great cause by hey, getting the fans out that's here? That's just it. It's a great cause. It's a great charity. It'll be fun. It's, uh, I'm glad we're involved in that program. You know, I know a lot of people who are involved in Embrace the Kids. So it, it's certainly uh, a, a nice thing we're doing. I'm excited about our alumni's behind. Rutgers wrestling committees behind it, so that's really a great thing. We're excited about that. So we ask all of our fans, you know, if they're not doing anything Saturday afternoon, you know, to come out. I'm sure they're going to be still in for a couple of days here. Let's get out Saturday afternoon. Let's support it. Yeah, you know, we finally have all the our fraternities and sororities in the house. That's kind of a neat thing. We're not usually known for having a, a fan base from the students, so it'll be great to have some students in attendance. And so we're excited about it. It should be a great atmosphere. Usually wrestling at the barn it is a pretty neat atmosphere. So. We're excited to see that thing packed. All right, great. Thanks, Scott. You got it, man.